what's going on? I'm back with part two to this video. Uh, we're back on the vanilla Minecraft server, and uh, we were working on our house uh, a little bit earlier. I just went back to my other island place, got some materials, got some dark oak wood, got some uh, cobblestone, which we're going to turn into stone later. And I wanted to grab some jungle wood as well, just in case. And Zach said he was working on a building uh, near my bar, but I'm not going to worry about that quite yet. I just want to give you guys a quick tour so uh, when you come into Super City this is what you guys are going to see and it's not done yet Super City is always going to be an ongoing process because we do something and then we try to make it look better always right so whatever you see usually doesn't stick we usually try to make it look better as much as possible but this is the entrance right here for those of you who have never been here you walk through the center and you got these two giant pickaxes that Zach made uh, a couple days ago. I think they're a nice little touch, you know. You gotta walk underneath it. I'm gonna show you the town hall really quick. Zach like uh, vamped this up or whatever you want to call it. And we got a couple new council members. So uh, Pick Lisa and a couple other people, they didn't stick. I don't know if they've not been on the server or something like that. But we got uh, Xander Crash as our new town council. I think he was here last time. Lego guy's still here. I'm still town admin. And we got Peppy as co-mayor and Chris as co-mayor as well now. Uh, they've been do they've been on the server pretty much all the time. I took a couple days break. Uh, we got town admin as Smoothie, HRAD, and Chance is now the recruit council. So we'll see what kind of new stuff he brings to the table. And we got two new open spots, so if anybody wants to, uh, you know, come here for like trial or whatever, come out and help with the town, it's pretty, pretty easy. You just got to be on the server quite a bit, offer to help out as much as possible, and uh, just uh, ask if you want something to do, you know. So we're going to come this way because I noticed a couple things. I tried not to look over here as much as possible because I didn't want to spoil it for myself. But I noticed that we have a bank here. This was not here before, guys. Uh, so there's a big money sign up here. And let's just see what these signs say. Note, go to the shopping mall to buy, sell, and more. Oh, this is the so uh, shopping mall. Super, Sitter Super City Dollar Store, now open. Okay, so it's the dollar store. It's not the bank. Never mind. I was going to say, because we already have a bank. So we got these two villagers just chilling here. His name is Hay. I don't know if... That's kind of cool. I didn't know you could tra uh, change their names. I think that's actually really cool. What is this? Just I'm breaking. Eh, it's not that big a deal. So what are these? Do not buy large quantities. Okay. So you can buy one stone for 16, I think. Or 16 for one, one buck. You can sell, same thing. Yeah, that makes sense, right? Everything's a buck at the dollar store. So you can buy a stone, logs, cobblestone, white wool, redwood log, and cooked beef. I thought I'd be able to open that, but I guess not. But, uh, and then we have this too. And I'm thinking it's the graveyard. Yeah, I wasn't sure. Welcome to the Super City Cemetery. I really like this idea. I seen it from the other side um, over near the park. And I was trying not to look at it just so I didn't spoil it, right? So let's check out who's in here. Sea Raven, City Council, February 2014 to May 2014. So he was part of our council, but he's just not active enough, I guess. I haven't seen him on very much. Ice Raven, I think that these two are brothers. Not really sure. Uh, City Mod is no longer a thing. City Mod, I'm not really sure what that means. There's an open gravestone, a couple other open gravestones. Uh, so pretty good job. What's in here? Is this like a crypt? Co-mayor, Cobra, 671, City Council, Snowfire, 91. Oh, rip. Oh, my God. That is so bad. So Cobra, if you guys don't know, uh, he's one of our really close friends on the server. He used to be on all the time. And uh, I think he just quit Minecraft in general. I'm not really sure. And we got so Snowfire91, which is Amy. You guys see her in a bunch of my videos. Um, but she only comes on on Friday afternoons. And she's not really active anymore. So she didn't make the city council cut. Uh, but these are two pretty close friends to me and Zach. So 
that's why they're in the script. That's pretty cool. I really like this idea. Is that the only entrance? No, there's another entrance. Okay, good. Oh, what is this? Recruit Council, Pick Liaison, and Mickey253, Town Council. Yeah, these were the two that just got removed, I believe. So that's kind of cool. Whoever doesn't make the cut, I guess, will be over here. Um, I'm hoping I keep making the cut, to be honest. Like, I know I'm a town admin and everything, but uh, I've just been really busy with, like, uh, at home and stuff like that. So I haven't been able to be on the server as much as I would like to be. I used to be on for like almost 8 to 10 hours a day. Uh, Zandy's Mini-Me. Buy and sell your yummies here. <laughs> okay. A Mini-Me? It's like a mini shop. I be buying, I be selling. Xander Crash selling coal and carrots. And buying them ink sacks and diamonds. Uh, unless he's selling those. I don't really remember. Maybe he's buying coal. I really don't know. What does this mean? You can't buy here. Ink sack, you can't buy here. So that's only selling, right? Let's buy some coal. Yeah, so these ones are to buy. These ones are to sell to him. So he wants to buy diamonds for 17 bucks. I don't really know if anybody's going to do that. That's not a very good deal. But hey, whatever he wants to do, right? Horse parking lot. It doesn't look like anything really changed. Maybe some people claim some of these parking spots. Lego guy, Serena, number four, number five, number six, number seven, number eight. Maybe we should claim one of these right now before it gets overflowed, right? Peppy's horse, cold mod, name. Um, I don't know yet. Xander crash, 15. We might need more slots. So, I wanted a slot that didn't have any. Because none of these horses are technically mine, right? Um, oh well, number four? Yeah, let's just go number four. Let's do it. Alright, where did that sign go? There she is. And it was right behind there, right? Whoa. Hey girl, get, get out of here. Alright. So let's put uh, Bionic Havix. Or a stable. Good enough. Good enough for me. Claiming one of them just in case. Um, wow, that is actually really cool. I didn't see this before either. It's like a fountain. Oh, that is pretty cool, dude. I'm liking it. It's a nice touch. Because we were wondering what we were going to do with this river. Uh, you guys probably seen in a couple other videos where it's completely dry. Somebody added water to this. And I am going to be having a fishing tournament really soon, um, hopefully in like a week or two. But I do got to finish my house first, and I'm going to show you guys that really quick in a couple seconds. Um, I'm going to get a fishing tournament spot done, and everybody in the town will be able to go there. Well, pretty much anybody on the server, really. And uh, this person just... Oh, never mind. I thought they didn't have doors for a second. So this is what draw my drew my attention. Uh, Zach is making a historical museum, I believe, or history museum, whatever you want to call it. And let's just take a step back and appreciate this. This looks pretty cool. It's got a lot of depth. It definitely gives you that big, uh, big kind of stone building feel, right? Like you know, in the, in the towns and stuff, where you walk into a library or something like that, it's just unnecessarily big. That's the kind of feeling this gives you. And there's Zach up there. Hey, man. Say hi to YouTube. Uh, so I'm just kind of showing this building off. He's like, hi, YouTube, LOL. Oh, what do they got here? That looks, that looks pretty cool with the gold block and the, and the clock. Gives us the exact time. I wish I could make a vid. Why not? Zach also records, if you guys don't know. Um, laptop is broke. Damn, son. George is... Just, I'm using my mom's at the moment. George is trying to throw out a shameless uh, promotion. <laughs> LOL. Starfire Anime. If you guys don't know, check him out. I don't know. 
I've never seen his Instagram, but Zach's going to town. And that was wild what we did last night. Oh, what did we do last night? I, I did something else last night, but uh, <laughs> I was with a different person last night. Anyways, so this is what Zach's up to. And I'm going to go show you guys my place. Now, you know, take it easy in the comments. Whoops, carefully, you weren't recording. Hopefully you weren't recording. <laughs> uh, yeah. Yeah, but it's secrets out. <laughs> out now. <laughs> oh, well. So I'm going to show you guys my place. I'm going to keep trying to go and see uh, Global Chat. The world will know. Damn. I'm just gonna look at the park really quick. Yeah, the park looks fine. Okay, I don't want to show you guys my house quite yet. I'm trying to just not look at it because from this angle, it probably doesn't look that great. All right, now we should be fine. And uh, actually, I'll show you guys the bowling alley too right before we get to my place. Let's just tear this down right there. I helped work on this a little bit, but pretty much all credit goes to. Uh, I still type. Pretty much all credit goes to. Hmm. I actually don't remember who made this. I think it was Xander, maybe. I don't remember, to be completely honest. Alright, I think we're going to take this out and put glowstone there. Just looks a little bit better than the plain old stone. The stone looks good and everything, but it needs to light up. And torches aren't going to cut it. Alright, looking good, looking good. We'll put some like uh, glowstone behind there, but it's not a big deal. So yeah, this is the uh, Super City Bowling Alley that we have so far. I think it looks all right. We even got a place back here for your drinks and stuff like that. But as you can see, this isn't finished yet. And over here, it's just uh, the shop district, but this is has not been really touched at all. We just kind of torched it up a little bit. All right, so the grand reveal of the house. Are you guys ready? Now, take it easy in the comments, but this is all we got so far. I think it's looking pretty good. We got the nice stone fence that you guys seen earlier. And uh, I think it's looking all right. This is the bottom layer of the house. There's going to be another layer on top. And I want to maybe just make it one layer in the living room and then have it downstairs, actually. Because I want to keep it like a modern looking, right? modern looking building really kind of flat really low to the ground so I think this is doing the trick so we got these glass panes here uh, three high and we had some snow I'm trying to give it like a dark oak snow kind of feel but it's really hard to do and this is what the inside looks like so far I'm gonna show you guys this other spot right over here we got this little like hot tub kind of thing going on this little jacuzzi so yeah I think it's looking pretty good we got lots of detail in here um, pretty good front door if I gotta say you know I made this in probably like an hour half an hour I kept taking breaks just because I had to go get snow and I had to get stone I had to get glass all this different kind of stuff so now let me just throw some of this in here I'm gonna actually take that out one two three four five six I believe does a stack I really don't remember Two, three, four, five, six. Honestly, can't remember. I turned my dub stuff off just to record the video. This glass is done cooking. All right, good job. I'm gonna dump all of this stuff in the chest. Uh, let's just throw that on the ground. Actually, we didn't even need to do that. Just trying to make another chest. Come on. There we go. Oops, oops. Throwing stuff on the ground. Don't need it apparently. And we'll put all of this kind of stuff in here. Just dump it all. So for the floor, we're going to try sandstone. If that doesn't work, we're going to use some of this jungle wood. I want some more stone in my inventory. And uh, some snow would be nice as well as a stack. Actually, let's grab two stacks of this. All right, so let's keep building now. 
So this is the first floor. I kind of want to keep it, like I said, I might not add an upstairs. If I do, it's just going to be like a little balcony just to kind of overlook the, uh, the water area because we have this really nice backyard in our place. And this is where the fishing tournament's going to be. I think I'm going to make an extension off of the park would be a good idea. That way while we're having the fishing tournament, people can chill at the park too because it's a really good focus point, you know. We put a lot of work into that. Might as well show it off a little bit. And uh, that fence, it's looking good, but we can cut it like right where my cursor's hovering over. Right in the middle, we can make a little dock and have a big fishing tournament here. And I kind of want a balcony so you can see it from my house, like overlook it. Um, because usually for the fishing tournaments, I host them, but I don't be in them. And if you guys are wondering, anybody on the server, there are lots and lots of good prizes. I used to give away like stacks of diamond blocks. Well, not stacks of diamond blocks, but I think the first place was like 10 diamond blocks or something like that. Now, bear with me because this server did reset and I haven't been as active as I usually am. I'm not going to be giving away 10, 10 diamond blocks. That's just not going to happen, right? But I can give away a half stack of iron blocks, a stack of iron blocks even, maybe, and definitely some diamonds and some cool books and stuff like that. Um, it all depends. Maybe second place will get like a, a book, first place will get diamonds and iron. I try to give first, second, and third um, all the prizes, really because it makes people want to play, right? If one person has a really high fishing level, he's probably going to get first, but second and third can also still win some pretty good stuff too. And it just makes it fun. It makes it time worthy. So you don't feel like you're wasting time. But yeah, I'm usually not in the competitions. I usually just watch from afar, see who gets taken out. And if you guys don't know, um, on the server, when you fish, you have like a random chance to get TNT and that usually knocks you out of the tournament but I'll get into that in a different video um, whenever I get the fishing the fishing hut done I gotta think of a really cool design but that shouldn't be too hard so you guys are just gonna listen to me ramble on while I uh, build this house and I'm not gonna build this whole house in this video obviously this is gonna be uh, an off and on project right like I'll try to do basically oh, what am I trying to do I'm basically gonna try to do like this living room today and I'll just do a little update videos to show you guys how it's coming along and stuff like that that way uh, it's not one extremely long video but I'm just trying to give it some depth give depth give it some flavor and uh, make it easy on the eyes you know and I think that's really important in Minecraft you have a really nice looking house uh, I think it's pretty important because it makes you want to play just like texture packs sometimes you just need something pretty to look at right that's why guys like chicks all the time you need something pretty to look at every so often so we're gonna actually pull this out right here maybe does that look alright yeah let's just keep it like that I'm sure it'll end up changing but I'm alright with this for now maybe even just do this this might be alright. Uh, I need more wood. <laughs> oh, my keyboard is like sticking. There we go. This that looks alright. We'll keep it like that for now. Um, do I want to pull this out? Yeah, we got to pull this out maybe at least three. At least. Mm, man, I can't put blocks down. I wish I had some dubstep playing too. So that's what this is looking like so far, guys. Uh, I think I'm just going to keep it like this at the moment. Let's just extend this out. And this wall isn't going to be dark oak. It's going to be like windows and stuff like that. But for the moment, I'm trying to add lots of depth and detail into like every part of the house. So you got to just do wall by wall by wall. And if you try to do too much detail all at once, it will make your building look like crap and it won't be symmetrical it won't match right 
So you'll be putting a lot of blocks down and then all of a sudden you'll go, oh crap, that doesn't look very good. And you'll tear all that detail down that you just did. At least that's what I find anyway. So yeah, this is what our living room's looking like so far. Obviously we're gonna have like a couch and stuff like that in here. We can put like a wall if we want. Um, so let's, let's just get a feel of this. Let's walk through, right? Sorry if this is a little bit jerky for you guys. So you have a nice view of the front of the house. And I'm gonna change this a little bit. I'm gonna make those into slabs. But I just wanted like a kind of step feel to it. So it's not exactly what I want, but it's it's close. It's good enough for now. So you come in here. What kind of floor should we have? Maybe sandstone? Let's try it. That's what I originally planned on, because I do like the look of sandstone as a floor. And we also have these uh, prismarine blocks too. We don't have a great amount of them, so we do gotta use them sparingly. But they can add a lot of uh, detail to the house. Like maybe for the bathroom or kitchen or something. So you walk in here. Yeah, it's it's not bad. And I did bring some clay over. But the clay is also brown clay, right? And if you look at these two blocks, they're pretty similar. So I don't really want to use that. I could use I could use stone, but stone as a floor, uh, it's kind of yeah, it might look okay actually. Maybe we can try. And I also wanted to try, what else did I bring over? I think it was jungle wood, yeah. I already got some jungle wood on me. Uh, so between these, I think that's all I really wanted to try. I know the jungle wood's gonna look good, but I just wanna get a feel for everything else too. So let's try the stone now. Let's get a look. Yeah, that may be all right. So this is gonna be at least five, we'll go seven. I'm trying to use odd numbers right now. Uh, this is going to be, I think this will be the living room here. Yeah, so we are gonna add some jungle wood. But before I do that, I did wanna make this kind of drop down and I don't know how exactly to do that but basically what I'm trying to talk about here is ooh, that jungle woods like really cherry wood looking I like that a lot kind of like this but we gotta obviously add um, slabs and stuff like that so the floor is gonna be like here but I think for this half of the house we should just keep it at the normal level but anyways, I'm going to work on that a little bit later in my off time. Um, probably not going to do any more today because I've been working on this for about an hour, an hour and a half now. And I just want to take a little bit of a break from Minecraft, to be honest. I played some pretty good league, league games today. Um, I'm just looking at this. This is going to be like the backyard, right? We can obviously make this pool a lot bigger. we got to make some kind of deck. And... Uh, yeah, I don't know. I'll figure it out. But I just wanted to show you guys in a little update video, and it's looking pretty good, I think. Take one last quick, quick look from back here. We'll take like a screenshot if my hotkey is still set up as that. Yeah, it is. Okay, good. And sorry for the sore throat too. I've been drinking a little bit tonight, so my throat's kind of just like taking a beat, and <laughs> you know what I mean. So. I think we're gonna put most of this stuff back and we're gonna grab some stone bricks and we're gonna go help Zach out a little bit not too much because I do want to get off pretty soon and just uh, go to bed or watch some videos or something like that I actually have to upload all my videos I just thought about that right now I've been trying not to upload today because when I upload and record at the same time it's really really laggy and it's not it's just not workable um, I'm gonna be having some more modded, modded Minecraft games for you guys soon. Um, at the moment, every time I try to play it, it just kind of it's really laggy, and um, I have to like restart my computer after because of the lag. Like even when I close the program, it still makes my computer feel really heavy. That's the only way I can describe it. Every program I try to load makes it really, really heavy. 
But uh, yeah, I'm either going to help Zach or I'm going to go upload one of the two. But I think it's looking pretty good so far. Anyway, let me know what you think, what, what I should change. If I'm going to add a second floor, um, maybe give me some ideas or something like that or for the inside interior. I'm not the best at building houses, but I think this is pretty good. So, yeah, anyways, I'll uh, see you in the next couple videos, guys. Uh, make sure you check out my League's videos, too. And I'm going to be having some more Counter-Strike games for you. I've just been waiting to play with friends. Um, but, yeah, everyone's schedules are kind of messed up right now. But hopefully you enjoyed the video. See you guys.